The Department of Irrigation reports that the water levels of the rivers in the southwestern part of the country have begun to subside with a temporary reduction in rainfall. However, a number of localities remain inundated. Several low-lying areas in the vicinity of the river Kalu, including Horanabulat Singhala Road, remain submerged. Meanwhile, several areas in Gaul, including Baddegama, Agalia and Dodangoda, remain inundated owing to the high water levels of the Ging River. Flooding prevented several schools in the district from opening. Overflow from the river Nilvala continued to affect a number of localities in the Matara district, including Kaddua, Katuangoda and Aturalia. <laughs> A number of landslides and tree collapses were reported in several areas. Meanwhile, a 17-year-old from the Ganegama area in Baddegama was reported dead after being drowned. <laughs> The latest reports from the Disaster Management Centre estimate that 284,505 individuals belonging to 74,313 families across 23 districts are affected by the adverse weather. 12,638 of those individuals are being temporarily housed in 204 relief centres. 31 deaths have been reported while the number of missing persons stands at three. Against this backdrop, the government has decided to provide a special allowance to households affected by flooding. 10,000 rupees will be provided to every family affected by floods in order to clean up their houses. The government has allocated 150 million rupees for this purpose and the relevant funds will be provided to district secretariats. Health officials warn that prevailing flood conditions may result in an increase in the spread of infectious diseases. As mosquito populations increase during the monsoon rains, we see an increase in the number of dengue patients. We expect these numbers to increase further because of the prevailing floods. In the meantime, the National Building Research Organization issued landslide early warnings to several districts. Accordingly, Level 1 watch warnings have been issued for several areas in the Kalambo, Kalutara, Gol, Hambantota, Matara, Kandy, Kegol and Ratnapura districts, while Level 2 alert warnings have been issued to areas in the Kalutara and Ratnapura districts. The Department of Meteorology Meadville forecasts light showers in several districts. We expect several rounds of showers in the western, suburban, southern and northwestern provinces as well as the Kandy and Nooralia districts. Also, there is a possibility of showers in the north and northwestern provinces. Showers or thunder showers may occur in the Uwa and eastern provinces during the evening or at night.